you said here when everybody was writing avant-garde music, he stuck to his guns and stayed to whatever he believed. Where was your compositional instincts taking you and what were his comments and how did he influence your direction musically? Yeah, this is a very good question. At the time, I was studying at Columbia, which is also primarily avant-garde music. And he knew that. But he also saw the other side of me, which I you know, had pieces that... Uh, I wrote with folk folk music style. I had a lyrical side. I think that was part of the the thing that he saw in me that he thought I was hopeful. So he finally, you know, he he would say, he said, you know, one day you have to figure it out the harmony. You know, this tonal versus atonal. That was very overwhelming at the time a discussion. So you either tonal or atonal composer. So you can't have both. 